Finally on 10 News, he may not have much time left. A young San Diego man denied a kidney transplant and his family says it's because he has Down syndrome. 10 News anchor Riel Creighton has the family's emotional plea for help. Well, about half the people who get on a transplant list will die while they're waiting for that life saving organ. This family tells me that while they were never specifically told their son was being rejected because he has Down syndrome, it was easy for them to read between the lines. There are five in the Wellman family. Four of them will tell you it's James who holds them all together. He's just the love that and trust. A 26 year old who loves nice dinners, long walks and baseball. So we're gonna go back in. Maybe the, yeah. the Padres will find a way to win this one, huh? Yeah. He has autism, is nonverbal and has Down syndrome and his kidneys are functioning at just 12%. His mother says James is in end-stage kidney disease. If he um, doesn't get a, a kidney, yeah, he's going to keep losing function. Stepping out from a Padres game, the family making a personal plea for help after two major transplant programs in Southern California rejected James. The reason, says his brother John, was obvious when they sat down with the director of one of them, Down syndrome. The checklist, the things he'd talk about to then give us the ultimate no. Of course, it was a devastating blow each time to hear that no, uh, we are not going to give your son the life saving procedure that he needs. John, really bad, had hoped to save his brother. And it makes you feel really bad for all the other people who've been denied. Unable to donate after he was diagnosed with diabetes during testing. In terms of me what, doing what I can do. <laughs> I thought I could uh, get things to the finish line and I couldn't. They say James has changed all of their lives. They're praying that someone will step forward to help them save his. Riel Creighton, 10 News.